Does your GTA Vice City Next Gen Edition works like this? Don't worry, I got you. Hi and welcome to my video. In this video, I will tell you how to fix lag in GTA Vice City Next Gen Edition. This video has three phases. Phase one is about how you can make Next Gen Edition graphics vibrant without using ENB, because the built-in ENB requires high specs to run. Phase two includes a low-end graphics mod for low-end PCs. Phase 3 includes a graphics mod for extremely low-end PCs. So, let's get started. The Phase 1 has begun. Now extract the Reality 4 2.0 folder. Then click on Open File Location on Next Gen. Now copy these folders that I am copying right now. Make sure to replace all of them. Make sure that you turn off the ENB script. Now you can change your video settings to low, but I am not going to change it because I have a good PC. As you can see, Next Gen now has vibrant graphics without EMB. Now let's move on to Phase 2. Now extract the GTA 4 for low-end PC folder. Now follow my steps. Copy the common and PC folders except for the GTA 4 optimization. Now see that the graphics are a lot worse. If this doesn't work, then let's go to Phase 3. Now extract the GTA 4 for FPS laggers. After that, copy the common, PC, and command line files into the Next Gen Edition folder. Again, replace everything. Now the graphics are even worse. I hope this works. I know the render distance is not that great, but still, it's better than nothing. Now there are some important things I want to tell. Now to download Phase 1 Reality 4.20 mod click on the link provided here. Now to download Phase 3 mod click on first latest version of mod. Now some people not going to like the resolution 512 by 384 that comes with Phase 3 mod to fix it. Open command line then remove width and height, then save the command line. Now make sure to always keep off the ENB mod. Hey, thanks for watching this video. If this video helped you lag fix, then make sure to subscribe and happy gaming.